Hi guys, I just wanted to make a quick video about uh, a package of components that I received from Farnell. As you may know, Farnell is a well-known company in Europe and I think they also work in the United States. And uh, they, they are doing a pretty good job in uh, distributing uh, electronic components. So this is the first package that I uh, personally ordered through Farnell. When I was in a company, I used to uh, order the stuff um, from the uh, sale department. They were just ordering and just giving me the package, the the um, the component itself. So I had never seen uh, packaging of funnel myself. And also, when I was in the university and I am still in, uh, they do a lot of uh, orderings from funnel. But uh, what we as students see is just the uh, the package, uh, the component itself, not the package, but I was uh, quite surprised with the quality of the package. As you can see, they have their own uh, formal branded box, and I think it's a recyclable uh, packaging. That's a good thing. Always consider the environment. And I already opened this, but I didn't go any further because uh, then I said, okay, let's make a video about this. Okay, as you can see, we have here um, seems to be like the uh, the factor. Um, yeah. Okay. One thing about Farnell is that uh, if you are not a company and you are ordering as a individual or as a personal order, your order should be about uh, 50 euros. If it's not about 50 euros, they are not gonna process your order. So that's something that you have to keep in mind. So as you can see, it comes with some protective uh, uh, papers. Uh, I'm surprised that they haven't used uh, this bubble stuff, air uh, protectors. This is not good for environment. Don't use these companies, please. And what is it here? This is the components that I ordered. And it seems to be inside a bubble wrap. Quite neat. Let me zoom in a little bit. Yeah. Okay, let's see what we have here. So I'm expecting uh, some uh, through hole uh, ICs plus some speakers and microphones. Let's see how good they. Uh, they did the packaging. Hmm. Don't have patience. Oh shit, I destroyed everything. Okay. Mm, nice. Nice. Oh. It's a nice packaging. I don't know. Oh, this one should be my uh, the op amp. This was uh, quite an expensive one. They have it in a, a really nice package. A vacuum package for a um, true hole IC. It's a waste of money or not. And the point is, I ordered this uh, yesterday at 12 o'clock and I got the package. Um, the day after, like in 9 in the morning. And I don't know how their uh, distribution works, but I think this package was originally came from uh, United Kingdom. And I live in the uh, Netherlands. So it's it's a quite fast uh, um, postage service. And uh, the postage is free for Farnell. So if you order about 50 euros, then you got everything for free. I mean, the uh, shipping costs is nothing. So I have... Uh, Two hole component here in this vacuum box. I have some other uh, two hole components. As you can see, they are in these uh, ESD protective sh shield bags, and uh, they are uh, they are they are sealed. Okay, I'm going to open them and show you. And oh, one of these uh, these very not very good uh, e static electricity protective packages. 
I don't like this. But uh, it's okay for the components inside. This just some um, microphones, miniature microphones, and uh, should be okay for this. They are not very sensitive. I hope. And some more, uh, some more normal stuff. Some true holes more. And these are the some. Uh, Speaker mini, yeah. These are the speakers that I needed for my project, and yeah. Okay, let's see uh, how do they, how do they do it uh, with these uh, true hole components. So as I said, uh, this aesthetic uh, ESD safe package, and uh, inside this is this uh, tube. I'm going to open this. I don't have a trusty knife, so I have to trust my uh, teeth. Almost. Okay. And also comes in these nice tubes. As you can see here. Anti-static. Good. And uh, this is just some 8-pin uh, through hole components. And uh, the good thing is they have these uh, little uh, needles that uh, protects the chips from moving up and down because if, if they move up and down freely then they will uh, produce a lot of static electricity and uh, it can be dangerous for the chip so it's a good uh, countermeasure to ESD stuff okay but uh, the problem is I don't know actually how to <laughs> how to um, to remove these things maybe I have to break it or something anyway I think I have to break it yes so this was the uh, packaging for true hole components now we have a bunch of speakers not a special kind of packaging it's just a normal uh, normal plastic bag I'm going to open it uh, I think I should use my trusty tits not tits but tits or tooths. I don't know the English word. <laughs> okay. What do we have here? Hmm. Lloyd speakers. Or loud speakers. In Dutch we say Lloyd speakers. Yeah. Three of them. Hmm. And I'm wondering what's inside this. Opamp uh, 2835 ID. This is the main opamp for my project, so I don't trust my trusty uh, tools to open this, so I need to do it with a sizer. So please wait a little bit. Unfortunately, um my camera didn't record uh, the opening of that uh, vacuum um, package but uh, this is what was inside uh, there's some uh, anti-humidity uh, stuff and uh, the interesting thing is uh, since this was uh, this some sort of uh, SMD uh, SMT I say is uh, they um, they also put this uh, humidity indicator card so as you know uh, SMD components are um, relatively uh, uh, susceptible to uh, humidity just in case of soldering if the humidity goes over uh, some specific level uh, here it says uh, bake parts if 10% is not blue so if the humidity goes uh, um, down or something then um, 
you will have trouble uh, soldering this stuff I think or uh, maybe something inside goes bad so they require you to bake these things um, in a special oven like 100 degrees or something for like few minutes so they they come back to uh, full uh, full functionality yeah so this was the uh, um, basically uh, a review of uh, packaging of Farnell I really liked it and uh, I have to say uh, uh, the price for the components were quite reasonable uh, especially for the uh, amount or the quantity of the components I ordered usually if you uh, order things in like uh, hundreds or thousands you get a lot of uh, a big discount but uh, I had those are rather, rather small projects so I was okay with like two or three of each component anyway um, I hope you uh, find this uh, video useful and um, see you soon bye